I am a teacher, a fifth grade special education teacher in an urban district just outside of Boston. Um, my son, Sam, is 26 years old. Um, and I think in my heart, I really always knew that he was gay. And I was comfortable with that right from the beginning. Um, I have a brother who is gay and has been with his partner for over 30 years. And it is something that um, is just part of our family, part of our life. And I love him with my whole heart. I have since he was a tiny baby and right up until today and forever. Yes, I'm the regional director for PFLAG and I sit on two board of directors for two wonderful nonprofit organizations. And I have been um, involved with the LGBTQ plus community since my son came out 13 years ago. Um, I think back when he first came out for me, um, it was a little challenging just because I didn't know much about the community. So it meant, it meant that I needed to get more knowledge. Um, for me now, I'm honored and blessed. He has filled my life with joy and it's just wonderful to have him in my life. Um, I've learned so much about not only about the community, but about myself and um, how to overcome challenges as a mother of a gay son. Um, I am a photographer. I have a 22 year old son named Milo. And um, he didn't really need to come out to us. It was very obvious to us when he was quite young that he was gender nonconforming. And he he led us to um, and me on a journey as a photographer to discover a whole community of parents who were looking to support their gender nonconforming quite young children at the age of seven. And um, I've been blessed with two gay sons. Um, whom I love so, so much. My, uh, I have a 38 year old son that came out, uh, oh, I think uh, almost 25 years ago. Um, and then I have a 35 year old son that didn't follow short. He followed pretty shortly after that. And so uh, we supported him growing up in Utah. It's a very conservative uh, religious area. Um, so it was really hard for my children. Um, my oldest got bullied. Um, but we supported and loved our children from the very beginning. It's such an honor to have all of you on our board. And I'm just immensely proud to have people with your caliber serving. It's just really incredible. So what does being on the board of Gay Sons and Mothers mean to you? I'm really pleased to be on the board to find an organization that is all about acceptance and love it makes me feel more connected to my son, my brother, my friends, my colleagues. And I think it has given me a voice to speak more openly and confidently and proudly about gay issues. Um, it's given me a community. Um, it, it has really meant a lot to me personally and made me I think more confident in being an advocate for um, LGBTQ plus people. Obviously my connection to my son is very important. It's always been um, important since he was born. Um, I only have one son, so he gets all of my love, <laughs> but just being a part of this organization has um, brought a lot of joy to me just to, to hear other mothers to be a part of something bigger. Um, it's taught me a lot, you know, about myself, about um, struggles. And then also it's helped me um, open a platform for the Latino moms in um, being able to support them because I know it's challenging, um, you know, just another layer to add on to um, all the challenges that we have. Um, so for me, it's just filled my heart with joy and um, I'm happy to be a part of this organization and to continue to be an advocate for the LGBTQ plus community. I love being a part of a community that shares a common thread. I think our experiences are all different, but they're all also very much similar. It's, it's really important to me and my family that I'm a member, but also to my son. And um, I want to be a good role model for him. And I want him to know, you know, how much I do support him, not just through this whole photography thing, but just like as a, as a mother um, who's in a group that, you know, is doing whatever I can to um, help move, you know, Rick's mission forward.
I get so much joy out of looking at Instagram and seeing all the new um, moms and their sons on um, on Instagram and, and, and just all the love. And that wouldn't have happened without Rick. So I feel very honored to be able to be on this board and um, and just help um, with that platform to just let the, the moms know that they're, you know, love your children. And and um, there's just so much to our children and just to love them.